My plans after high school, I would like to pursue a degree in manufacturing and engineering. Uh, I plan on being a mechanical engineer. I want to be a teen counselor. I want to be an ER surgeon. Um, I want to be an archaeologist. A rapper. A uh, graphics engineer. Uh, when I grow up, I'd like to be a performing artist specializing in horn. I either want to be a biomedical engineer or a pharmacist. I want to be a nurse when I grow up. Today's students are tomorrow's business and community leaders. West Virginia's future literally is being shaped in public schools right now. However, the state's high school graduation and college attendance rates cause reasons for concern. One of every four West Virginia high school students failed to receive their diplomas. Of those who graduated, only six in 10 went on to post-secondary studies. We need a profound cultural change to alter this way of thinking. This attitude shift must occur in every facet of society, including students, teachers, parents, communities, businesses, and state and local governments. The Education Alliance serves as a bridge among these stakeholders through partnerships, policy advocacy, and demonstration projects. This is my second year with the Walk the Talk program. And the most exciting thing that I'm hearing from students is the one-on-one -on -one mentoring that's going on. And they really are establishing uh, a close relationship with these adults in their lives. And there are a number of students that uh, really do not have that type of role model in their life. So this is at least one person who's making a significant difference. I think it's an outstanding program. I find that I, um, by interacting with the kids on a daily basis uh, or on a weekly basis, that I see them daily and they approach me and, and, and talk to me where otherwise they probably wouldn't. It has helped me a lot. Like, I've gotten so much more organized with all my work and I've gotten a lot, like, a lot better grades than what I have in the past and it's really helped me. I think it's really helping me get a head start in college what I want to do. It's a lot more helpful than what I thought it would be. I mean, it's an experience of the most that you get to meet new people. And the teacher, he, he's amazing. The kids are excited. They, they want to become successful. They're beginning to think, maybe I can graduate. Let me help you. And that's, that's been the attitude of the mentors. And, and it's been an exciting situation. Uh, three years ago we started this program with FIRST, which is an uh, international competition that uh, brings groups of high school students together to, to build a robot and work collaboratively to come up with a solution to the problem. And so we've taken that and, and um, we've evolved that over the last three years. Um, the SEEDS grant has allowed us to uh, implement Project Lead Away, which is a pre-engineering program that fits really well with what we were already doing with FIRST. And so uh, it's given us, these students an opportunity to gain credit in something that they were interested in, in involved in anyway. So it's a, a good combination of robotics and the pre-engineering program. The, the SEAS grant has allowed us to develop Project Lead the Way courses at Wayne High School. And what that will do is that expands their knowledge of the engineering program. So there are several different classes that they can take. And um, so these students can use that base that they're getting with Project Lead the Way and either apply that in college or the real workforce. I've learned that many people have a lot of different ideas and that you have to find the right one and sometimes you can find middle ground with certain ideas but it's a, it's a very good learning process and it, it teaches you to use a 12-step design process and you start out with just how to solve a problem and it's very, it's very good. Um, I think it's a lot of fun, uh, mostly because it's out of, I, I'm a part of a lot of programs and out of all the programs, uh, this is uh, like a big problem solving experience where we're told here's 
we have a problem, can you fix it for us? You know? We all sit together and talk and we uh, come up with a solution and watch it come to life. There is no doubt that West Virginia students can be as well prepared for college or career pathways as any students in the nation, or in the world for that matter. The Education Alliance is eager to lead this effort as we strive together to envision and build a new West Virginia.